Washington Athletic Club for the opening of the senior championships. Matt McLaughlin from Lenexa, Kansas, up against John Bike, who has that huge back wall set up and gets that first point. John Bike is currently named, ranked number one on the senior tour. Two. John from zero. Hesperia, California. Screen ball. Yeah, I was gonna give it to you. Two serves, one screen. Side out. Zero, serves two. Short ball. Second serve. Two serves zero. John Bike has two, Matt McLaughlin zero. It's a one game match to 25. Win by two. Point. Three, serve zero. Replay. Three, serve zero. Short ball. Second serve. John Bike forgot his John Bike goggles, those crazy goggles that John's synonymous for back in Hesperia, so he is wearing his wife's sunglasses. Zero serves three. As safety goggles. Point. McLaughlin gets his first point. One, serves three. Matt McLaughlin won the 40 national singles one year. Point. 2010, I believe. Two, serves three. My, excuse me, it was 2011. Point. Three, serves three. Matt hit that a little too hard. Matt frozen there. That ball popped up, but he didn't make a move to his right. Three, serves three. Matt beat John Dave pretty convincingly in Denver in the semifinals. John's saying, Dave, but I packed two pairs of glasses. He can wear those for liar's dice and handball. Hmm. As you know, Dave. Point. Deception is key in Liar's Dice, and hiding your eyes dramatically enhances your All ability right. to deceive. Matt, do you need a towel? No? Particularly, Dave, when you're climbing the ladder into the... All right, that's a point. Four, serves three. Seven fives or eight sixes. <laughs> you don't want to give anything away. Well, how many people are at the table? That's what I want to know. Three. So how, many how many dice? 14, no wilds. Ooh. Wow. Yeah. That's I three. But you know that you four. have four. Well, I'm going to call regardless. Okay. You say that, but I don't see it happen all that no, much. I don't like to call. I'm, I'm tempted to go up to uh, eight, seven. Where are we at? Eight sixes? We were at seven fives, and then we went to eight sixes. Oof. I'm going to yeah, pull that on it. that. Prove it. Mm. Side out. Four, serves three. Nice serve there from John, but a great return from Matt. Point. Matt hangs out in the backcourt there, never really removed himself from the returner's Five, spot serves there. Three. Gave John a big opening, and John took advantage of it.
And that's a terrible error Point. from double M. Six, sir. M. Three. Mick. Screen ball. Thought he was bothered by it. Late call, and it was a good return. Surprised that our referee made that Two call. Serves, so one screen. Matt punched that ball up to the ceiling. Had a pretty good spot there screen in the rally. Ball. And now this is rare. You don't see two screens in a row very often. Second serve. John Bike, a member of the Seattle Wax. Although he will not accumulate Super Bowl points for his senior play. Have to play in the race for eight right only to pick up senior points. Three serve six. Great serve there from Matt. Here's a big setup, and he takes care of it. A flat Point. rollout, front wall, side wall. Four, serve six. Matt not happy with his performance in Salt Lake City. Coming off a finals appearance in Denver, Point. got shelled in Salt Lake City by Dan Armijo, 25 to 10. Five, serve six. Said he went back to Kansas City and really trained and focused and you're seeing a different Matt McLaughlin, at least in the beginning of this one game match of 25. Matt six, now serve six. has reeled off three consecutive points. Make that four. Great A serve there from Point. McLaughlin. Seven, serve six. We want to welcome in all of Matt's fans and family, supporters in Kansas City. A lot of those guys watching at the Kansas City Athletic Club, supporting their man. Big setup for John, Point. but he puts it in the floor. Yep. Eight, serve six. John was off to a nice start here as he built a 6-3 lead, but now it's all Matt McLaughlin. He scored five consecutive points. Combination of ace serves, kill shots, and a couple of John Bike airs. Unlucky there for John as that ball Point. just catches the side wall as he tries to make contact. Nine, serve six. Side out. Six serves nine. Side out. Amazing shot there from Matt McLaughlin. Nine serves six. John Bike is only one of two players in this event Three to play. have ever won the four wall national singles titles, Paul Brady being the other. John Bike has won two, 1991 and 2003. Nine, serve six. John Bike was the last guy to win a four wall nationals besides David Chabon or Paul Brady. Point. 10, serve six. All right, timeout, that's your first. One minute. One minute timeout. We're going to take a quick break here in the booth. Six. We'll come back in just one minute. You stay tuned. My name is Bruce Fabrizio. In 1975, I invented Simple Green based on three principles. It had to be safer to use, it had to work, and it had to be completely made in America. 
From generation to generation, Simple Green has been cleaning everything from car engines and tools to kitchen counters and floors. No matter what you clean, indoors or outdoors, clean it with non-toxic, biodegradable Simple Green. All right, time in. Score is 11, serve six. Welcome back, Mac McLaughlin on an 8-0 run here. Make that 9-0. Dave John Bike took a 6-3 lead. 12, serve six. And since then, it's been all Matt McLaughlin. John just calling a timeout. But Matt comes in with an ace serve right after the timeout. And there's a, a hand air from six, serves 12. The pride of Kansas City. Short ball. Second serve. John just seems to have trouble with Matt McLaughlin. Nobody else on tour. Replay. Six serves 12. Short ball. Second serve. And the crowd really getting into it here. They are. Seven a long rally 12. and you heard some clapping from the crowd there. You have to play. That ball hitting John right on the on the goggles as they went by. You took that time out and came 12. back in with a new set of goggles, John Dave. Well, we'll see if he'll Short be able ball. to wear those during Liar's Dice. He clearly Second wasn't serve. comfortable wearing them here. The semifinal match. If you're a John Bike fan, Dave, you have to be a little bit worried because he's only winning rallies on Matt McLaughlin airs. Hasn't really been able to put the ball down. And of course, as I say that, Dave, it's a classic John Bike on the rise, stiff arm kill. Point. Eight serves 12. Short, check the ball, second serve. Twelve serves eight. Dave, the senior tour was created for the boys in Hesperia Lake, and it seems to be maybe putting Point. an end to their handball career also. We saw John Robles retire as a result of it. Nadia Alvarado says this is his last eight. event. Our only hope is that you move there. Need to move there to retire. Eight serves 13. The score is eight to 13. Short ball. You'll be happy to know, Dave, that last time I lived in Tucson, Second I retired serve. from handball for nine years. My next retirement will be a lot longer. Can't wait. Retire, I go from the seventh best to the sixth best. 13 mm. serves eight. You play handball? Short no, I ball. retired. Mm. So sixth best at what then exactly? Second serve. I'll even retire. I'm still well, you have to play to be well, in the I don't know. top. Not really. So. No? Well, then Fred Lewis is the best in Tucson. By that logic. Point. 
point. Fourteen serves eight. I'd like to welcome in Dave John Bike Jr. three months from now on Vimeo. <laughs> and I'd like to welcome John Bike Sr. who's watching live. He and John's mother Maureen who are enjoying this action from the beautiful right Tucson, Arizona sunshine. They're not enjoying it as much as they thought they might have, Dave, as they see their horse down eight, 14 to 14. eight here in the first half. It says game Short. one there, Dave, but it's actually a one game match to 25. Second serve. That will be a fine. <laughs> Point. For the broadcast. What should it say, team. Dave? It should say one game to 25. Okay. That's what we talked about at our Nine meetings. Nine serves 14. And now, Dave, this is a dangerous time. Matt McLaughlin has a nice lead Ten about to go 14. to halftime, but he hasn't yet closed it out. John has now scored three consecutive points with this Z Point. serve. And Matt McLaughlin, I thought was gonna take a timeout there, Dave, he probably should. 11, serves yeah. 14. I thought I heard him say timeout. 11 to 14. And now it's Point. Dave John Bike completely turning this match around in a matter of 60 seconds. 12, serves 14. He scored four points and he's right back in this match. John Bike is only one of two people in this event, and that's a flat rollout from John Bike, either in the Point. race for eight or Pick senior down, race William. for eight. Dave, who has won a four wall singles national championship, of course, Paul Brady being the other. John Bike is the last guy to win 14. a four wall singles national championship, not named Paul Brady or David Chapman. And John takes himself out of the box there, right Dave, but not before he climbs and claws his way back into this match serves with a five-point run. Very Short nearly ball. tied the score there at 14. Could have been serving for a halftime lead, but you have to think even if Matt scores this 15th second point, John serve. still has the momentum coming into the second half. Yeah, that's true. Just love these 25-point games. Well, apparently you're the only one. Actually, I spoke to a couple players, it, Dave, who said, right you know, out. I'm just tired of these emails. I just said whatever they wanted to say just to get off the email chain. So I'm actually not the only one. Not according to the emails. 13 wow. serves 14. <laughs> 13 to 14. And all of a sudden, Dave, Matt McLaughlin has just fallen apart here. Point 14 serves 14. We're all together. This is half point and there it is John goes right. into halftime half. with the lead 15 to 14 somehow three we're going to take a three minute break we'll be back in just a bit stick with us here at race for eight.com Are you getting this, honey? Oh, prime time. We are rolling. <laughs> All right, Mama's going to bring it home. Mama's okay. going to bring it home. Okay. 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 Come on. <laughs> watch this guy. Oh, oh backwards. Oh. Woo! Don't. Okay. It went into Bob and Carol's yard. Oh, no? Okay. Yeah. Here it yeah. goes. Oh, oh my oh. God. Challenge your kids to be active and eat healthy. Yeah, All right. Let's see what you can do. Let's go. They might surprise you. Search We Can for more ideas on how you and your kids can get healthy together. There are a million places you'd never consider texting. So why would you do it while driving? Leave risky driving to the professionals. Stop the texts, and together we can stop the wrecks. Working and working out takes a lot of energy. That's why I drink Zenergy. Feeling fantastic and looking good has never been easier. Zion, extreme science for your active lifestyle.
My name is Bruce Fabrizio. In 1975, I invented Simple Green based on three principles. It had to be safer to use, it had to work, and it had to be completely made in America. From generation to generation, Simple Green has been cleaning everything from car engines and tools to kitchen counters and floors. No matter what you clean, indoors or outdoors, clean it with non-toxic, biodegradable Simple Green. Back in Seattle, Washington at the Washington Athletic Club for the second half. John Bike down, nine to 14, came back. Now we have now 30 more seconds. 15 to 14 here. It's a one game match to 25. It's a semifinals of the senior division. That's anybody over the age of 40. Matt McLaughlin versus John Bike. Matt actually 44 years of age. John Bike 47. Up after this will be Andy Shad and Dan Armijo. All right, guys, time in. Matt Servant. And on paper, that looks like a great match to watch. Score is 14, serves 15. I'll bring your lunchbox to that one because you're going to be there a while. Dave, how does Matt reestablish momentum? Point I mean, that's a, a great start. Inside out, fly kill. You get just the right spin on that shot where it rolls through your hand and stays down and on the wall. 15 serves 15. We're all together. I don't know how that's 15. Matt was returning the serve, right? No, Matt served that. And point. now Matt with his second consecutive first strike point. 16 serves 15. Matt, Dave, goes to his cell phone at halftime where he gets updates and messages right out. from Tommy Little who tells him what he's seeing during the live broadcast. 16. Well, one of those things that Tommy texts was, reduce your hand airs. Actually, also. Tommy told me Dave, as a coach, he doesn't like to point out the negative. He likes to focus on what his horse is doing right. Point. I can only speculate, but Dave, I believe Tommy being downstairs in the vicinity 16 told sir, Matt, 16. You got to rely on your first strike game. You're not winning a lot of long rallies. So you got to concentrate on your serve and your next shot. And he came in and scored consecutive points because of it. Now Dave, Matt hits one out of the stadium. And is that a replay, right. Dave? It's a point. It should, it should be a side out or a point, depending on what it is. That was part it of the rules. goes out the back, it's a point. That's right. You asked that question during your match, but everybody knows it was written down as one of the rules. A ball that goes out. And Dave, the is that a lost ball there? It is a lost ball. Oh, I don't understand how there's, it's a lost ball. I mean, I know there's six people watching, All but right. couldn't one of them What's find that ball? ball? It's not like it went onto Waveland Avenue. Yeah, Dave. I'm sorry, that's a point. That's a. <laughs> oh, well, thank you. It's a small back wall here. It's not the traditional 18 or 20 feet high. This is a 13-foot back wall, and players in the past have actually right, guys, resuming practiced play. hitting that ball into the gallery so just so they get back to the server That's box. not true. But actually, Dave, the recommended length of the back wall is 14 feet, and I believe this is 14 feet. Yeah, well, that's the rule here. I'm not arguing with the rule. I like the rule. Oh, nice little backhand of flipping. Look where John puts that ball, right in the spot. Now, these players act like they don't know what the rules are, but they all agreed to them. I'm not sure what there is about not wanting to know the rules. Right You're traveling 2,000 miles to come to a tournament, but yet you want to be ignorant of the rules. Is that part of being 16 hip? 16 serves 17. I'm not sure. <laughs> well, it you've like never been hip. I, just, I, I don't even care. Asking. I don't even care. I just flew 2,000 miles to get here, but I don't know the rules. I mean, clearly, if you're here, if you're here Dave, you care. Point. Another point for Matt McLaughlin, now tied at 17. 17, serve 17. Dave, I think Matt is a lot more comfortable here at sea level than he was in Salt Lake City where he was grasping for air. After just seven minutes on the court with the hand. A 
I hate that shot right there where you 17. You just think it's going to be a revolving door and it goes right or sometimes you think it's going to go around and it goes the opposite way. Nice shot there from Matt. But John gets his big paw on it. Dave, John Side is out. hitting a Z serve with his left hand into the left corner from the right side of the server's box. It's interesting. Normally you hit the Z serve closer to the left 17, side wall. Serve 17. Within five or six steps of the left wall. Short ball. I haven't spoken to John about this day, but I think that he thinks the angle is more difficult for the Second returner serve. from that right side. Point. Unforced there, there from John. 18, serve 17. Smart shot there from John, but Matt picks it up. Dave, you've played John, you just know how difficult it is to get points off of him. Point. Or how difficult it is just to play him. And I know that you you defeat him when you play him, but 19 he, serves he always seems to score about 18, 19 points or so. I mean, how difficult is it for Matt McLaughlin right now to have the lead against John Bike here? Well, I mean, Matt's, I think, got to feel pretty confident against John having beaten him when they played Point. in Denver. That was in March. Well, Matt's only five points away from defeating John Bike in this opening round. 20, serve 17. The four seed taking off the number one seed. Well, Dave, John Bike has outscored Matt 14 to eight since he took off his liar's dice glasses. So at that rate, Dave, you, you have to favor John unless he goes back to those liar's dice glasses, which could happen. And now, Dave, John with a Point. bevy of errors. Twenty-one serve seventeen. That seems Side to be out. one weakness from Matt is that he he plays back too far. Doesn't come up a little bit. Doesn't come up 21. far enough on his little red carpet. Big setup for Matt McLaughlin. Matt has to put that away. John does. Matt's frustrated with himself there, Dave. Well, both players had opportunities. Eighteen serves twenty-one. Nice serve from John, Dave. But Matt returns it perfectly. I like that return from Matt. And Dave Matt is a little bit tight right now. He knows the finish line is within striking distance. And as you know, Dave, you just a little 19, bit of tension will cause you to make some errors. And Matt's made a mental error in the last Short point ball. where he didn't put that ball away. And then, of course, John's 19th Second point serve. was a gift from Matt. Great shot from Matt. Dave, you know when the ball comes off that side wall, you're able to get your hand under it and get a huge reverse on it. So even if you don't kill it, the ball runs straight down the wall. The server lever just float it ball back up and give you a big setup or 19. not be able to return it like John did there. Oh, it Matt might win this. This rally, Dave, he's still in it. Yeah. And he does. That little trick shot kept him in the ball game there, and he gets a point. I think they call that shot the Dave Vincent. Good rally. All right, Matt, that's your first one minute. That's a good timeout right there. 22 serves 19. Matt McLaughlin calling that timeout. at this replay here brought to you by Tucson Rolling Shutters.
John gets a slow start there, Dave. And now Dan Armijo looking for a little camera yeah, time, board, Dave. Danny. Inappropriate, if you ask me. It is inappropriate because there are other courts around here. All right, you have 20 seconds. But the referee said, get off the court, Danny. You guys ready? Time in. I won't compare what just happened there to other sports. I know how much you serves 19. detest <laughs> that because we love the uniqueness here. It's all about being unique. Well, you should see uh, all the little tiny timeouts in NBA games, Dave, where well, everybody jumps onto the court. Everybody. There's cheerleaders that get mm -hmm. out there. They make special yeah. PA announcements. No, but I just don't. At the NCAA 22. tournament, the next team that's about to play is watching in the crowd because they're up next. They go on the court and shoot during timeouts. Handball is very intimate. Dave. It is. It's These unique. guys have an intimate relationship yeah. with their, their <laughs> ball and their court and their gloves. Uh -huh. They just can't wait to get on it and throw it. Good shot from John. Not a smart timeout from Matt McLaughlin, who is on a roll there. Takes that timeout. John 20, comes back and gets in the point. I think Matt was a little tired there. Tried to get his breath. Yeah, but John was tired too. Mm. That galloping, Dave, you just heard was it's a your find. Horse. Well, <laughs> well, my horse was just fine. Point. Now another point for John Bike. Matt McLaughlin with 22. Bike now at 21. Dave, I know this is a great match, but I am working on the finds here this week. I believe we're now up to $105, just four matches in. So it's shaping up to be a pretty good off season, is what I'm trying to say for you and I. Well, we have enough to upgrade our hotel rooms in Tahiti to the master suite. I just hope they have two of those rooms. Yeah, we don't like to share, actually. We tried it once and hasn't happened since. And Dave, you have to give the edge All right, resuming here play. to John Bike, a guy with so much experience and championships oh and John Dave turned back the clock there Dave was that John bike from 1991 that was an unbelievable shot 22. one of the hardest shots we've seen hit all together here that's gonna be tough if Matt lets it go and he barely gets it back but not to the front wall and now a point for John bike at 23 that's one of your favorite serves Dave 23 serves 22. John has mastered that serve. And this time he doesn't quite get it. Gives Matt an opportunity. Matt over hits the two wall pass though. And Dave, have you noticed when John needs it, he's got an extra 15% in the tank with his left hand. Yeah. He doesn't always show it to you, but when he wants to, it's there. Smart it's shot from Matt. Matt with Side the out. bounce pass. And now his heart's got to be racing, Dave. This is why he loves to play this unique game for these moments right here. Well, he almost hit a crack at that moment right there. Matt's holding strong here, Dave. Big setup, jump bike off the back wall, goes down low again. Matt gets it, but Good call. and falls down. Oh my! You need a towel? Matt McLaughlin needs a timeout right now, Dave. He'll be smart to wipe the floor and then call his timeout. Give himself about a minute and 50 seconds because he is winded right now. And who could blame him? 21 shot rally ended by a John Bike two inch high kill shot with a huge natural on it. Dave, that was 71 miles per hour. Well, John Bike back in the box here at 23 to 22. Matt McLaughlin had the lead. John Bike struck back right before halftime to go ahead 15 to 14 and then since that point, it's been back and 22. forth. Mm -hmm. Not a good serve from John, and Matt does what he's supposed to do there, Dave. Takes a lot of guts to hit that shot. 22 serves 23. Oh, I like that. Looks like you hitting it to the right, went to the left instead. The beautiful little feather left 
corner kill right there. Took a little off, did Matt? Just flipped it with his wrist. Point. I now we're together at 23. You have to win by two, but I thought Matt was playing the wrong shot there, but it worked out for him. Well, that little flip of the wrist was sort of like a paddle shot. Short ball. Second serve. Dave, I'm looking forward to hearing from whoever wins this match with our sideline reporter. This has been about as good as it gets. I know it's just a coincidence that it's a one game match of 25 that we're seeing the most exciting match of the day. Just like it has been all season. Well, they're just a bunch Nothing of coincidences. Nothing but coincidences yeah. in this unique sport. That you can't compare to any other sport. Look at that shot from John Bike to get the side out. Even though you're running and pivoting and stopping and scoring and well, other sports being tight. That. No, that's what I'm saying, but you still can't compare it to another sport even though you're going through right. the same feelings and Don't ever compare it to anything. Don't learn from other sports either. Point. And John gets it, Dave. Looked like a desperation shot. How does a guy like John just throw that ball to the front wall and hit it less than an inch high? It almost skipped in. Game and Here it is. Game and match versus 23. As John has 24 serving to win, and he hits a crack right. and gets it, and John yeah. advances to the finals of the senior championship, defeating Matt McLaughlin, who has to be just completely upset with himself, Dave. Well, tough loss for Matt McLaughlin, Dave. We're gonna hear from John Bike now as Tracy Davis is gonna grab a quick word John, with John. That was a hard fought match. Matt had the lead in most of the first half of the game, and you guys also met in Denver, and the outcome was Matt winning that one. What was the difference in this match today? I, I just came in with more energy and uh, it was a toss-up. We were both making shots in the end, but I made the last one, you know? All right, and great way to finish with that crack serve. What were you aiming to do that in, in the last point? Absolutely. Absolutely. Awesome. That was a <laughs> can't say anything else. <laughs> well, that was a great way to finish the match. Um, you are in the finals tomorrow. What are you going to do with the rest of your evening afternoon here in Seattle? I spend it with my lovely wife. <laughs> great answer. Well, thanks, John. Congratulations, and great watching you play. Thank you. Back to you, Dave. Thank you, Tracy. Good job. Good questions as John then holds the door for Tracy. That doesn't happen in any other sport, right, Dave? Where the player has to hold the door for the reporter. I'm not sure there's a door in other <laughs> sports. What other See, sport so has it a is door? Unique. It's it is so unique. unique. It is unique. That's why we're here. We are all that uniqueness. Let's come back to the booth here really quickly. Okay. And in Seattle, Washington, where Dave Fink and yours truly here doing this live broadcast, actually becoming good friends again. No. Are no. we not? Now, actually, you must have had a nice time there, Dave, at the Space Needle there last night. I know that I wasn't invited, but I'm sure it was fun for those that were. You missed out on a... Uh, uh, the, the Space Needle. Yeah, right isn't that it? Uh, that's the observation deck where okay. I was at last night. Oh. I wish you were there. Yeah. Well, I was out with sponsors last night. That's what we do here. At oh, events. okay. Yeah. 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 We uh, spend time with our sponsors. Not everyone's here on vacation. Coming up next, we'll have the other semifinal of the senior championship as we cruise through this players' championship in uh, Washington Athletic Club with Dan Armijo versus Andy Shad. We'll take a quick five-minute break. We'll be back in just a bit for I'm Dave. We'll be back. Stick with us. So what's it going to be? Uh, we could ride bikes, skating, movies, zoo. Whatever you guys want to do. Can we just do this? Yeah. We could just do this. The smallest moments can have the biggest impact on a child's life. <laughs> Take time to be a dad today. Working and working out takes a lot of energy. That's why I drink Zenergy. Feeling fantastic and looking good has never been easier. Science, extreme science for your active lifestyle. Here we go. We're gonna we're gonna make some juice. It's gonna be good. She's excited. A little bit of kale. Please don't put this on. I'm line. putting it all over the line. It's wet. It needs something. No, it'll go. Don't break my juicer. Looks good. You ready to try it? Come on, baby. Challenge your kids to be active and eat healthy. 
It's okay. Okay, all right. They might surprise you. And she took another sip. You saw it? Search We Can for more ideas on how you and your kids can get healthy together.